We welcome you to our theme film lab of CSIR Sikri Karekudi. This is the video on surface engineering for device applications. We have vacuum deposition facilities for doing surface engineering. Spark ring uses a glow discharge to generate argon ions which strikes the target surface and plucks out the atoms by momentum transfer. This is the magnetron sputtering unit at our lab. We have two target systems for sequential and co-sputtering. Conducting, semiconducting and insulating materials can be deposited with DC, RF and pulse DC power supply. We do coatings of transition metal nitrides and oxides in the form of single or multi layers and nanocomposites on surfaces to improve their mechanical properties and biocompatibility for implants, antimicrobial properties of medical fabrics, diamond like carbon, hard coatings for cutting tool applications, and thin film metallic glasses for surgical tools. Recently, we have added iron assisted confocal pulsed magnetron sputtering facility for doing co sputtering. Electron beam evaporation technique is an extremely versatile technique where the material to be deposited is targeted using high energy electron beam. The emission voltage ranges from 8 to 10 kV with a deposition rate of 10 to 100 Armstrongs per second. Materials with high melting temperature of about 3000 degrees Celsius can be coated. Presently, we fabricate platinum counter electrodes for dye sensitized solar cells and yttria stabilized zirconia for thermal barrier coatings. This is our pulse laser deposition facility. In laser ablation process, the target material gets ablated by high power laser producing plasma plume which then expands and condenses over the substrate to be coated. Reproduction of the exact stoichiometry is possible in this technique. An ultra high vacuum of 10 power minus 7 millibar is achieved in vacuum chamber as turbo molecular pump is used for creating the vacuum. We use krypton fluoride gas based laser which emits wavelength of 248 nanometer in the UV region. A carousel is used in depositing multi air coatings without breaking the vacuum. We fabricate thermal metal oxide nanostructured coatings such as molybdenum oxide, tungsten oxide, vanadium oxide, zinc oxide and mixed oxides for electrochromic display devices, supercapacitors, DSSEs and foldable intraocular lenses. Thermal evaporation technique is a simple and robust technique in which the material to be coated is resistively heated using electric filament where the filament current is around 200 to 300 amperes. Materials with melting temperature of about 1800 degrees Celsius can be coated. The deposition rate is 1 to 20 Armstrongs per second. We make silver contacts and gold electrodes for electrochemical sensors and photovoltaics. A roughness profilometer is used for analysis of roughness and thickness of the surface coatings. Mechanical properties like addition, coefficient of friction, wear can be measured using ball and crater and block on ring instruments. Electrical properties of the coatings can be obtained using two probe and four probe techniques. Electrochemical studies were carried out using electrochemical workstation 
part stat 2273. Biological characterization can also be done in our lab. A laminar airflow chamber is used for avoiding contamination. Experiments such as antimicrobial studies through Kirby Boyer method, direct contact method, and by hemocompatibility testing are carried out. In addition to this, spin coating unit, microcentrifuge, reciprocal shaker, pH analyzer are equipped. Also, the lab is furnished with an inverted epifluorescent microscope for analyzing biological samples. This is our thin film group at CSIR Sikri Karikuri. Thank you for your attention.